Happy good morning and welcome back to Hope Scope. I forgot to put on my rings. Much better. Where were we? Oh yeah, welcome back to Hope Scope. Or if this is your first time here, hello, I'm Hope You're Liking Queen. And you have arrived at your number one source for all things fit fashion. Today we are talking about all things alphalete. Before I even get into what's going on today though, the Black Friday finasco. After the finasco of the champagne stealing incident. It's a lingering finasco. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay, I'm done. By the way, I am under no obligation to film this video. Nobody pays me for YouTube reviews. Nobody has ever paid me to be in photos or go to events or be in campaigns. I just do this stuff because I love it. But I'm really excited about what's happening with Alpha Loot this weekend. And also, let's be honest, some of you are here for the hot gossip. I know some people are upset about Black Friday, and if you have no idea what I'm talking about, there's a Black Friday sale on November 29th, 2019. Everything was up to 70% off. Due to extremely high traffic levels, you were told when you made your purchase that it could take up to 10 business days to ship your order. This is an issue many companies have when it comes to Black Friday because it's madness. So my personal athlete experience is I placed an order, took three weeks to get to me, because it shipped on the 10th business day. And between then and now, I've placed two other orders just as a customer, and I got all of them, no problem. But just because I have always had good experiences doesn't mean that everybody had a good experience. It did take customer service a while to get back to everyone. But as far as I have been told by Alphalete, all dissatisfied customers have been contacted and compensated. If for whatever reason you are part of those few that had issues and you have not heard back from anybody, please send me an email. I will do everything I can to get you in contact with somebody that can help general questions or comments about leggings. My comment section and my DMs on the gram are always open for you. And they have made some serious changes to ensure that you guys are getting the best experience and the best products possible. I believe in this brand so much. Of course, there are some items that are not my favorite. I feel like a booba. <laughs> And now, can we please get into the review? This is what this channel is about, our mutual love for leggings. And boy, do we have some good ones today. Okay, today at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time, I'm gonna have all the time zones down below in the description box. Not only is there a huge launch, but it's one of the biggest sales they've ever done. So all of the brand new releases are gonna be up to 25% off and everything that's currently on the website is going to be at least 50% off for 48 hours only. On the Alphalete website, there's a little who sent you box so you can put Hope Scope in to support Leo and I. It's not a discount code and it doesn't cost you anything. It just lets Alphalete know that you came there because you like my reviews or you think Leo's cute. <laughs> Speaking of Leo, um, he's with his grandma right now. Tyler and I are working on some stuff that you're gonna see soon, but um, All right then, keep your secrets. That require Leo to not be here for a second. He will be back in the next video though. Okay, I'm gonna start with what you must get from the new releases. If you can just only get one outfit from all the new stuff that's launching, it's this. Not specifically that color combination, High Christmas, but it's an Alpha Lux set and an Aspire top. Let's get into this Alpha Lux because that is what I am the most excited for. It is unlike anything that they've ever done. In the Alpha Lux line, there's going to be the legging and two sports bras. These Alpha Lux leggings are an amazing blend of comfort and functionality. This is the first time that they've done a material that is brushed both on the outside and on the inside of the leg. The material blend is also different than anything that they've done before. 75% nylon, 25% spandex. So it is ultra stretchy, but has some of the best shape retention in a legging I have ever seen. I don't know where my black ones went. They got lost somewhere in my laundry gauntlet of black leggings, but I've worn and washed them a few times now, and they have held their shape amazingly well which sometimes with these buttery soft leggings is not the case. One of the best features of these leggings is the tapered waistband. A lot of time I find that my leggings are really snug in the butt and thighs, but they slide off my little waist. Not in these babies. Let's look at that. Feeling snatched up. So fluttering. Okay, before I continue, I'm wearing a medium in these. I wear a medium in all the Alpha Lee leggings. I saw a breath already. We just started. Oh. As far as sizing goes for all of their stuff, they say all their stuff is true to size, which is true. But if you're like me, and you're right in between sizes, I would suggest sizing up. Especially because their waistbands are so compressing that you want to base the size that you go with off of how your leggings tend to fit in the bum and thighs. You're not gonna have to worry about this part being too big. And then as far as length, there's really not that big of a difference between sizes. I'm gonna have all my measurements down below. I'm gonna pop them up on the screen here too so you can use those as a reference. I'm also quite tall. Okay, the waistband is double lined, high-waisted and seamless at the top. My favorite part is how it dips down in the back here. 
And then these seams just make your booty pop. And then they also have this super nice raised rubber logo on the back. These raised rubber logos don't crack like a regular screen print does. They have good sized pockets on both sides. I'm not gonna lie, I have the like Pro Max giant whatever phone. And it's kind of a tight squeeze, but it still works. It doesn't go anywhere. Generally, I don't like to wear leggings that are like buttery soft to my high intensity workouts, but I do enjoy these for my more intense workouts. You might notice a tiny bit of sweat showing in this color as well as the blue. Black, no issues, of course. But compared to most leggings like this, I feel like the moisture evaporates very quickly. Another very important feature, no camel toe. And some of their previous leggings, I know I and some others had issues with that. None here. Really nice long front seam. They're also very squat proof, which most brushed leggings are. 92% squat proof to be exact. <laughs> so even with the dark colored underwear, you have a hard time being able to see through these. I came up with a universal, scientifically correct formula for determining squat proofness, which I'm gonna explain in my next YouTube video very thoroughly, but just take my word for it. They got a 92%. <laughs> brushed leggings are also very nice for hiding cellulite. Doesn't show at all. Overall, I would say these are mid to high compression leggings. Suck everything in, but still move with your body quite nice. Very much recommend these leggings. I'm wearing the raspberry color here. The two Alpha Lux sports bras are the Elite and the Tri Bra. If I had to go with just one of the two, it would be this Elite bra. I feel like this one is more of a medium to high support where the Tri Bra is a light to medium support. Oh, the fabric is so soft. It just feels flawless and dreamy against your skin. There are removable cut pads in the elastic band along the bottom. It doesn't dig in anywhere on your shoulders, doesn't rub anywhere. But my favorite part, but my favorite part is the back. I just love these meshy straps. They're kind of like a jersey mesh material. I just feel like it's really unique, a little more eye-catching. They definitely like accentuate your back and shoulders and then pull your waist in. And then it also has the little raised rubber logo. These have probably been my most worn sports bra lately. Okay, here's the tri bra. Still a beautiful bra, the same material as the leggings and the other bra. These ones just have the little straps here, also removable cup pads. And then the cute little three straps that meet together on the back. Like I said, I just find this one to be more of a light support. Still nice, but not something I would grab for cardio days. Wait, but I actually really like this color on me. <laughs> I thought the red was my favorite, but... Um, another thing to note about this material though, if you do have fluffy friends or if you shed a ridiculous amount like I do, <laughs> you might find that it clings to this fabric. That just tends to happen with brushed fabrics. Okay, the other must have that I mentioned are the Aspire tops. So these come in cropped full length, long sleeve, short sleeve, tank tops. This is a long sleeve crop obviously, but this isn't the one I'm the most excited about. I like the Aspire Tanks. It's a little wrinkly because I just pulled it out of the dryer. For all my gals that aren't about that crop top life or that super fitted top life, <laughs> because it seems like that's all the brands like Alpha Late tend to do. This is for you. <laughs> so I just have the little logo down the side here, kind of an open back. A really good length though, where you can still see your leggings, but you're covered. Okay, but the reason that I like these tops is the fabric. I mean, you can see how lightweight and thin it is. Also like a brushed cottony fabric, so it's ultra soft. Oh, they're just amazing. I was first introduced to this fabric because I actually bought some of the men's shirts. <laughs> they're so nice. So if you want something even more oversized and long, you can get the men's stuff. So these tops have been available on the website. They're not a new design. So the new colors are what are launching on so the new colors are what are launching on Saturday, which is this light olive. There's a navy, berry, and burnt orange. So those are all gonna be part of the up to 25% off, but then there are gonna be a bunch of them that are 50% off. Okay, so if you own, or if you're familiar with the Alpha Elite Surface leggings, there's the Surface Path and the Surface Pocket, you're probably wondering what the difference between the Surface Pocket and the Alpha Lux are. I will tell you. But to rewind, I actually wasn't the biggest fan when they first came out with the Surface leggings. I just felt like that front seam mm, kind of fall off in my business. But I decided to give them another try when they came out with the camo because it's beautiful, once again. Um, really collects hair though. <laughs> and they are so much better. They fixed that inseam. And these ended up being one of my favorite leggings of 2019. They're bringing out the new navy pocket ones and then in just the regular surface they're gonna have navy and teal. Anyway, the difference. <laughs> so the surface leggings are not quite as dense. They're totally different fabric blends. So these ones are polyester spandex. And I would consider these almost more of like a yoga legging where the new Alpha Lux are more of a performance legging. These ones are a little bit lighter weight. And the main thing is the surface are brushed on the outside of the fabric, but not on the inside of the fabric. Oh, and they don't have the cute little raised rubber logo. <laughs> 
because I'm dumb and I care about that. These ones just also have the straight across seam on the back of the bum. They don't dip down like the Alpha Lux does. But if you're not a huge fan of a compressing fabric, the more dense fabric, then you might actually like these better. These are also going to be available in shorts form in the new color. And then all the old surface leggings, including the camo, are going to be 50% off or more. But like this camo deserves a moment. <laughs> I never got around to reviewing it, but this one has like the cute crisscross waistband and the matching haltery triangle sports bra. Okay, if any of these camo sets are still left during the sale this weekend, get them. And the other surface thing that I have is the surface crop. I actually haven't put this on yet because I just thought it looked weird. Whoa, retreat! Ow! It just happened! <laughs> See, it's tricky because there's like a random hole in the... And then it has a hood. I feel like a booba. I just, maybe if you had more muscles. Anyway, moving on. There's also a surface sports bra that's releasing that I really like that's kind of that. This same triangle halter sports bra situation is real cute. Okay, let's move on to some seamless stuff because that's what Alphalete's known for, in my opinion. I think that's what they do best. Okay, wait, before I keep going, I gotta order some Chinese food for me and my grandma. Hi, I wanted to see if I could place an order for pickup. Um, could I please get two of the dinner portions of the mandarin chicken? Okay, sounds good, thank you. Shoot, it's gonna be ready in 15 minutes! <laughs> New halo legging colors! Okay, I have said before, I'll say it again, Alphalete makes my favorite seamless leggings. Some brands have come close. But these have yet to be knocked out of first place. <laughs> They are just so plushy and stretchy. The three main seamless are the Revival, Halo, and Arrow. The main differences are really the patterns on them, but the actual fabric can fit themselves are all very similar between the three of them. The Halos just have this kind of subtle ribbing that accentuates the glutes. And then the Arrows have the actual like mesh within them that forms this cool little design. But overall, I just think that the Halos are the nicest most clean design that's still really flattering. So the new colors are gonna be this aquamarine, burnt orange, sage green, mineral gray, and black. Okay, I wanted to show you, so these were the blue halos that previously released. I just wanted to show you in comparison to the new ones. The aquamarine are a little bit lighter and have a little bit more of a teal shade to them than these previous blue ones. I know some people have had issues with like Seams coming down on these halos, they did improve the seams. They went with a flat lock seam with slightly better construction, so you shouldn't have any issues. I personally haven't had any issues with them at all, but... Once again, if you're between sizes, I would recommend sizing up, though. Just to ensure that they're squat proof. And they're already a pretty dense legging. As far as squat proof ability, the darker colors obviously do better. The lighter colors like this one score about an 86%. So I would not wear dark underwear with them. Probably would be able to see through it. But with a neutral color or no underwear, you're good. So like I said, these new colors are going to be up to 25% off. And previously released colors are going to be 50% or more off. Okay, normally I'm not a fan of cropped hoodies. I just don't find myself wearing them very often. But this new Atlas cropped hoodie is really cute. It has the pocket, half zip, logo. I just really like it. This is a small on me, so you could even size up if you wanted a more oversized fit. And then they do have the brushed inside. This is the light gray. It's also coming in black and white. And there are some new little Lux tanks coming. I love this shade of tan. These are more of a fitted cropped tank. This is the small. And they're made from a pretty dense cotton, but it has like a cool feel to it when you touch it. The best thing about these is the cute little overlapping hem in the back. So these are going to be available in tan, ember, raspberry, and white walker, which is like a super light blue that's really, really pretty. And then I think the last notable thing that is new that's releasing. Oh, and then the last couple of things I wanted to mention. You gotta get a hoodie when they're on sale today. Like a full length, just plain old hoodie. <laughs> they're the best hoodies in the entire world. I probably have like six or seven of these. <laughs> but this one and the cream one I wear the most. They have the nice like rubber logo, but just super subtle. They are just so cozy. Like they are hands down the best quality, best fitting hoodies I have ever owned. So jump on that while they're 50% off. And then also the premium joggers. These are the ones that I was wearing earlier today. I believe these ones have been on the site. So they should be 50% off. These are the clay color. Their premium joggers are my favorite joggers on the entire market. They also have some cottony ones, but I really like these. They're more of like a performance feeling jogger that you could work out in if you wanted to. Nylon spandex. So they have kind of a legging feel to them almost. That tapered jogger fit. They seriously just hold up so amazingly well and you would not regret this purchase. The only thing with the premium joggers is it's not as bad as like a brushed legging, but you do get a little bit of lint and hair that sticks to them. But that's literally the only downside. <laughs> these ones don't have the zip pockets so it's just an open pocket and then the little logo on the side but some of the premium joggers do have the 
zip. Same fit and feel though. For sizing on the joggers, I can do a small or a medium, but I generally prefer the medium. If they're too tight, I feel like the pockets get kind of bunchy and weird. I like the slightly more relaxed. Then they do have the adjustable drawstring waist you can always cinch in. Yeah, that's it. Hope this video was helpful, it gave you some idea of sizing, what's worth getting during the sale today. Like I said, you can use my code if you want to support me. If not, totally fine. But I hope you get some good stuff. And Leo and I will see you guys in the next video. I gotta go pick up some Chinese food. <laughs> see ya!